Hey YouTubers, just thought I'd do a quick little uh, update. Yes, two videos in the same day. What the hell's wrong with me? Um, I got the tower in place, the G tower as I call it. And I have starter plugs put in there. And this is going to be kind of hard to see because that grow light is right here in my way. On the left side I have rock wool plugs and on the right side I have the walnut shell plugs. Got them in there all the way down. And there goes the camera going, I can't figure out where the light is. Um, somebody asked, how do I water this thing evenly? Well, here's my water line is coming in here. I had to uh, make a quick little adaptation. What I did, as you can see, is I put a T on there. Maybe you can see. Good grief. Anywho, there's a T on the end of that water line tube that comes in. And it sits about a half of an inch away from the wall of the tower on the front here. And it drops the water basically right on top of the top two uh, starter plugs. And as they saturate and shed water off, it just keeps dripping, going straight down. And as long as this thing is plumb, um, your water is going to fully saturate each one of these. I don't know if we can see it. Might be able to, but all of these plugs are now saturated with water. Um, and I also put a strip of metallomedia in the back there, right up against these plugs. So as the water splashes through there, it also goes through the metallomedia, you know, to help give the tower some biological filtering capabilities. And yes, I know uh, I'm using a rain gutter down here on the bottom now. I got rid of those receiver cups for these towers because if they start splashing, those cups don't really help. The tower or the gutter seems to catch all that. So I don't have water on the floor anymore. So that's that. I'm going to plant the thing tonight. Still trying to decide what kind of seeds I want to put in here as a test. But it's up and running and it's online and oh one more thing these towers over here my little V towers I found something that grows really good in them green onions I have to keep clipping the damn things off they grow so fast and parsley grows pretty good too so that's about all um, I'll keep you posted so it looks like we may have something new here that actually works and is a lot easier to plant doesn't need a tool to plant it zero maintenance take it easy people bye